that's what I want. All right, hey, I'm with uh, Tori today. This is John at CrossFit Dynamo. And Tori, um, you've seen some really great results since you've been with us. And I just wanted everybody to, to, um, to hear what you've been doing and how you've been doing it. So first of all, what, what do you do? What's your profession? So I am a firefighter paramedic um, for a local fire department. Okay, right on. So uh, you're active, busy, on shift a lot. Uh, it's a stressful type of type of deal, I would guess. Um, so why did you come to CrossFit Dynamo? What were you looking for? So I had been considering CrossFit for I don't even know how many years, but just kind of kept finding excuses as to why I wasn't going to join or why that wasn't the right time. Right. So. Honestly, I just put in Google CrossFit gyms near me and CrossFit Dynamo was the one that reached out to me the fastest, set up a meeting the fastest and provided like the most information, like right out of the gate. So that was ultimately why, like I already had a meeting set up with you actually the next day. So there was really no delay, no wait, no time to even think about it. Yeah, there were actually probably knowing where you live now, there were probably a couple that were a little bit closer. So I appreciate that. That's nice. Um, um, and, and, um, so what, what were you looking for? Um, you know, that you wanted to CrossFit, was it because, uh, it would make you safer at your job or, I mean, yeah. so what I was were you looking for? A challenge, ultimately a challenge in a community. Um, fitness has always been like a huge part of my life, especially at college. I majored in nutrition and food science. I'm a personal trainer. I have my certification. Um, so it's always been a huge part of my life, but I've always gone to the gym, to the gym and just done like heavy lifting there or so I thought heavy lifting, but I wasn't, <laughs> yeah, not as heavy as I was thinking, but I haven't really seen much of a change after doing that for, I guess, over a decade now. So I was kind of getting frustrated with that, that there wasn't a physical change a mental change. And then the lack of community, like you kind of walk into, you know, a major gym and everybody's got their headphones in and everybody's kind of on me time. And that's like, their stress release and that's great. But like, I wanted to talk to people and push people and, you know, really just have that drive together. So. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. So, okay. So um, I guess the, you know, how long have you been here? Do you remember um, when you started? Two and a half months. Yeah. I think you came up like the last day of April, something like that. So yeah. May, June, a little bit of July. Right. Mm -hmm. And uh, what kind of progress have you made since you've been here? So I'm actually really surprised. Not only the progress that I've seen, but like friends of mine have seen, like, they're like, we always knew that you were kind of active and athletic before, but they were like, it's kind of crazy how much you've already changed. And I've seen the progress too. Like I've always kind of felt like I was toned, but not anymore. Like now I feel like that's completely changed. So right. okay. that's been really good. <laughs> For my self-esteem at work, like being able to do certain tasks, like I don't ever second guess myself anymore. So. Right. So you've gotten stronger. Yes. Yeah. And we lost some inches in some places and put some inches on in other places that we wanted. Yeah. We won't go into the details of, <laughs> about that, but uh, you're, you're kind of getting to the shape that you want. Oh, you're yeah. You're heading, heading in that way. Okay. Um, okay. So, um, so the things I told you we do for you, we did for you, or we're at least on track, right? Mm -hmm. Um, how have you find like, found like the coaching overall and the programming and the, the gym? So I feel like there's a coach there for everything, especially with you and Drew and Kelly. I've been fortunate enough to take classes um, with each of y'all, but like everybody's coaching style is different. So like kind of based on the need that I have for that day, like I can kind of adjust where I want to be. Typically I go to your classes. Um, that's just where I find myself, which I'm not mad yeah. about at all, but it's very individualized. Like, you know what I wanted to work on and what I, where I want to be. So you push me to like work on my form that day, maybe better than my strength. And then we can kind of combine it at the end of the month when we do like the skills test or, so it's really, really focused. And I never feel like I'm going to get injured because you're always watching the form. So, and that's been like a big concern for people for CrossFit. I know. Yeah, that's that's our mantra, right? And it's kind of a, a something we get labeled with that even though it's a class, um, um, you know, a class setting, everyone we try to give everyone personal training in every class. That's awesome. Um, what about the community? How, how have you found the community to be? The community is everything I wanted and more. Like it's been absolutely incredible. Like I've only been there two and a half ish months, and I feel like I've been there for the decade that CrossFit Dynamo has been open. Right. Um, my second class there, one of the girls added me to a Facebook group. And within a week I was hanging out with 
10 to 15 girls at a winery as if like I had been talking <laughs> for years. Like it's been so great. And I talk to other people at other CrossFit gyms and like they don't really have events that they do together or they don't really hang out outside of the gym. And I just love the fact that there's been something so far every single week where I've seen people outside of the gym and we're always doing something, connecting, getting to know each other better. Cool, cool, cool. And it's pretty supportive in the gym too. Oh yeah. Like pushing each other. Like when you, like if you get done with the workout and you see somebody is still pushing and they're still working through it, like there is no downtime. Like you're cheering them on the best that you can, just the way that you would want it for you. So awesome. All right. Well, I'm glad that uh, things have started out so well for you and um, we'll keep tracking your progress as you go. Thanks for your time today, Tori. Of course. Thank you for having me. All right. Cheers.